Good afternoon, Tigers, and welcome to Tiger Vision News for Thursday, February 2nd. I'm Melissa, and this is my co-host, Kyra. Thanks for joining us today. What's up, fellow students? And did y'all know today is Groundhog Day? Which means if Punxsutawney Phil comes out of his hole and sees his shadow, we have six more weeks of winter. Let's see how that went. Okay. Hear ye, hear ye, hear ye. Stay on the now this day. second day of February, 2017, Punxsutawney Phil, the seer of seers, prognosticator of all prognosticators, was awakened from his broke to the cheers of his thousands of faithful followers. My faithful followers, I clearly see a perfect, clear shadow of me. Six more weeks of winter. He saw his shadow. That means we get more winter. I am sure ready for spring. <laughs> Me too. They've been celebrating Groundhog Day in Pennsylvania for a long, long time. The celebration is based on a German superstition that says if, it, if a hibernating animal casts a shadow on February 2nd, winter will last another six weeks. And if no shadow is seen, spring comes early. <laughs> now turning to other news, let's go visit the nurse and find out more about all the sicknesses going around the school. Hey, I'm Sean here with Nurse Balco. Tell us what types of sickness you are seeing most of this time of year. This time of year, our stomach virus is tapering off, but the flu and strep throats, terrible this time of year. How many students have been affected by illness this semester? Um, I don't have any numbers, but I do know my office visits are up and the number of kids going home with body aches and fevers um, is great. What do we need to do to keep others from getting sick? Same thing we've been saying for years. Wash your hands, cover your nose and your mouth when you sneeze and cough, and stay home when you're running a fever over 100. Thank you. professional folks roaming the halls today. Nice. Teacher Joe is tomorrow. <laughs> the class during each period <laughs> that donates the most cash to Art Drive will get to see their teacher get arrested and put in jail. The best part is that you won't have class. Make sure to bring some money. The drive's been going great and you all been doing a great job. But let's take this last chance to really push our donations over the top. Also, tell your family to make sure to eat at Blue Sky on February 7th. That's because it'll be an FMS Spirit Day at the 98th Street location. They got yummy burgers, fries, and onion rings, and we know you want some. So plan to go to Blue Sky on the 7th, and be sure to tell them you support FMS when you place your order. Now let's go check in with Gracie and see what's in our weather forecast. Hey, I'm Gracie with your weather. Here's your current conditions. You have partly cloudy, 48 degrees Fahrenheit, winds east 10 miles per hour, precipitation 10%. Here's tonight's regional forecast. We have no rain in our area. Here's our five-day forecast. Temperatures warming up into the next week with a little chance of rain. I'm Gracie with your weather. Back to you. Now let's see what's happening with sports. Hello, FMS sports friends. I'm Javon, and this is Cooper. Here's a look at today's sports. The city basketball tournament is this weekend. Let's check in with a few of our athletes and find out more about the big showdown. Hi, I'm Connor here with Coach Havens. When and where is the tournament? The tournament will be for 7th grade will be at Wilson Middle School and the 8th grade B team will be at Terra Vista Middle School. What time do the guys need to be there? Uh, both games are going to start on Thursday at 7.30 so we're probably going to have the kids there about 6.15, 6.30 that night. I'm Trista here with Coach Springer. When and where the, will the tournaments be this weekend? We'll be playing at Evans on Friday and Saturday. Which teams are the toughest for the girls? We'll be playing Laura Bush, hopefully, in the game before the championship. So on Friday, or on Saturday, you need to be there. What time do the fans need to be there to support the girls? Um, our first game is Friday night at 5, and then Saturday morning at 9.45 is when we play Laura Bush. Thank you. What are you looking forward to most about the tournament? Winning, 
Winning and celebrating afterwards. <laughs> Who's your favorite pro, ba pro basketball player? Steph Curry. Kobe Bryant. Thank you. The tennis teams are getting ready for their upcoming spring season. The first match is February 6th when the A team plays Cooper. The match is scheduled to start at 4.30 at the high school. Well, that's a look at today's sports. Back to you. That's all we have today. And thanks for watching Tiger Vision News. I'd like to give a shout out to Maddie, Maddie Brule. Happy birthday. birthday. <laughs> and thanks for being an amazing person here at FMS. Everyone have a great day. We'll see you later. Until then, Tigers. Bye. Bye.